its first ever Class 3A title and first overall championship in 58 years, 2017 was a year of resurgence for the Christmas Addicts Tigers. While it has been decades for the Tigers to reach the state championship game, most fans remember Christmas Addicts as one of the most dominant teams in the state of Indiana in the 1950s. Opened in 1927, Crispus Attucks High School was the first and only public high school for African Americans in Indianapolis. It wasn't until 1942 that Attucks was granted membership in the Indiana High School Athletic Association. Led by legendary head coach Ray Crow, Crispus Attucks became the first all African American high school to win a state title in the state of Indiana and in the nation in 1955 after defeating Gary Roosevelt 97 to 74. The Tigers were led by a junior by the name of Oscar Robertson, who scored 30 points in the championship game. While it was a momentous win on the basketball court, the players of Christmas Addicts, they knew it meant so much more off the court. That's a legacy that you'd like to have, that you know that you were a part of something like this, to break down racial barriers and to make basketball and all sports when you get it right down to it. That, uh, just get across those lines whereby color doesn't matter. It's a competition that we have. And uh, I just think it's great. It's beyond words. Addicts would return to Butler Fieldhouse the next year in the championship game against Lafayette Jefferson. Oscar Robertson, who would be named Indiana Mr. Basketball in 1956, led the Tigers with 39 points. The victory would give the Tigers back-to-back -back state titles and an undefeated season, the first ever in the state of Indiana. Addicts would capture its third championship in 1959 to close out the decade with three state titles. After all the success on the basketball court in the 50s, Christmas Addicts High School fell on hard times decades later. After rapidly declining enrollment with the Indianapolis public school system in the 1980s, Addicts would be converted into a junior high school in 1986, a middle school in 1993, but eventually would return as a high school in 2006. This season, behind second-year head coach Chris Hawkins, the Tigers look to repeat as Class 3A state champions and start their own legacy on the basketball court.